All right, we're going to do a bottle cap today. Bottle top, we're going to get the S1 dimension, the S2 dimension, the second snap height, the H1, and the H2 as well. So we're going to take our bottle and drop her onto the stage. And let's zoom in and go ahead and program it. So we're going to grab a baseline off the top of the part just by dragging that across. We're then going to get the bottom height here for the H2 dimension. Get a top up here for the H1. Get down here for that second snap height. Okay, let's let those attach. Now we're going to connect these lines together. Since they're not perfectly straight, as all plastics are, we're going to identify them as being an actual straight edge using data from both sides. So drop in both, and we're ready to go. So grabbing our H1 first from the top to the first row. H1 and the H2 from the very top to the bottom. Grab the second snap height from the top to the middle. And as we're going, we could be putting in design values and upper and lower tolerances if we know them. All right, let's put a center line through so we can get the S dimensions. I'm just going to drag through, hit apply. Construct a edge box referenced off the center. So we're going to look for the connecting point off of the center of these tabs here. And let's put in the S1, which we forgot to put in before. So we're just going to grab one side, grab the other place, S1, and the S2, which is from this point to this point. And that is going to be along the top of the bottle. So that is our S2. Okay, from here, we're simply going to register it. And by doing that, we're actually teaching it what the part looks like so that it can find that part anywhere on the screen that it wants. And lastly, we're going to save it. Okay, let's see about running it. So we come into the system, put the bottle on in some orientation, and hit measure. System's able to find the bottle, capture everything, print out report. Pull that bottle off, put a new one on, rotating it into a different orientation to make sure I don't have the same face pointing up. Hit measure again captures the data from this bottle. From here we can come into our main menu and take a look at our statistics. So I can pull up every bottle that's been measured and look at all the raw data for that as well as select any one of these dimensions and it will give me the statistics for it.